Okay, hi. I'm gonna try this, and 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 one can never accuse me of not having guts. Ekaterini, ek Ekaterini, Ekaterini, Ekaterini. I hope I'm saying now. She's got such a lovely name. F them. I don't even want to try because I, I wish I could pronounce this because it just looks like it's so eloquent, and rolls right off the tongue. Tongue, but I don't want to hack it. F the Mayadu. Akintieri F the Mayadu. That is just beautiful. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, okay, so here's where we're at. Um, I've got your presentation up here. Well, actually, let, let's talk about your this week's presentation because I've got that right here. And I, and I just want to take a look at that because we're talking about the, the trade show and that stuff, collateral and the giveaway. So you have, I will build a round booth. You can get in and it will have a table cut in half cut a table half cut round that will represent the earth cut in half but why 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 do you want to cut the earth in half we never you never said that in your in last week or this week you never really described what does all this mean this all has to fit into a concept so in other words if you want to use the trade show booth of cutting the earth in half somehow you have to write that into your concept do you, do you see what I'm saying? Like I'm cutting the earth in half to show that blah, blah, blah. And this is represented by this part of my presentation and also represented by this part of my um, um, uh, presentation as well. So do you see what I'm saying? So and, and so and then you have will be built round booth, flat panel and table under the faucet will represent water concern. Again, how? How does this worth earth cut in half with water dripping? And how does that present? How does that represent? Water concern. Build the round booth, flat panel, and a table in the middle. Okay, so I need reasons why here. Let's move on. And, you know, it's, I'm not surprised because actually I want to go back to last week. And this is last week's. This is last week's. And as and, and, and as you can see in last week, you, didn't, you haven't written anything. You haven't told us anything. You just gave us the sites, your citations, and some drawings. So I, I remember last week saying... Um, saying to you, hey man, go back and look at the, the assignment and look at some of my videos towards some of the other classmates so we can get on track here so you can see where you're missing. So unfortunately, I didn't see you do that. So this week's presentation is really, really um, underdeveloped. Okay, here's this week. So I, I mean, here's your, here's your collateral. What is this? I don't know what this is. Like save water, save life. You just got a dot here. I mean, I don't understand how how that is a collateral piece. Do you see what I'm saying? No explanations. Likewise here. So think about this. Think about being in a studio and having to present this work to your boss. And or, or better yet, how about if you're working for the head of a company and you are trying to sell this concept and he has no idea what you're talking about. So you have to tell him way up at the top. Or you have to say, okay, this is what I'm doing. This is my idea. Here's my thoughts. Here's a visual representation of my thoughts. Here's where my thoughts are going in terms of collateral. And here's where my thoughts are going in terms of giveaway. Okay. So now here, as far as the sustainability part has, here towards the end of your presentation, we have Green Depot carries steel framing. I don't know what Green Depot is. Um, Lead certification point at meat requirements for lead certification point. Steel is the most highly recycled commodity in the U.S. That needs to be cited. Oh, you did. Good job. Excellent. Structural steel can have a recycle recycled steel sounds regional. That's the kind of research I'm looking for right there. Yes, yes. Good, good. Giveaway. This doesn't mean anything. A recycled glass water bottle. You're going to give away a glass bottle. That's a really, 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 really bad idea. Um, because they're going to get broken. They're going to be broken all in the parking lot at the trade show. They, I mean, not people don't do it on purpose, but it's going to happen if you're going to give away glass. you got to really think about something. I mean, I think it's very, very conscientious in a sustainable manner to want to give away glass to save water, save life, use glass. Absolutely agree with that 100%. I just don't know if giving away glass is a great idea at a trade show booth i suppose i i think it would work i guess you could give glass away if you've got a good glass water bottle i don't know let's think about that uh and then collateral 
I'm sorry. I, I just, again, I mean, you, you can't really expect that somebody didn't know what this is because there's just no, there's nothing written or anything. So, all right. So I'm, I, I, good job. Um, get with me before we get any further or really, really start paying attention to what I'm, what I'm saying here, because before we know it, we, this thing is going to have to come together. So I have to have some written rationale here. Okay. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact me. Thank you.